Our Voyage is playing for almost five months now in London. They play seven shows every week and the arena is full on every performance every day. That's quite an achievement in and of itself. But there are not only those of us pilgrimaging to the arena who have been fans for so long. But every now and then you can spot some familiar faces. Famous artists, VIPs, celebrities. Let's take a look at who has been visiting the show so far and what some of them had to say. Hey, hey. So, our voyage started on the 26th of May 2022 and that grand opening was attended by all four members of ABBA but there were also many other artists in attendance. We can't go through all of them now but here is a list thanks to Sarah Russell from ABBAontv.com. We saw ABBA's director Lasse Hallström, many Swedish singers including Tommy Schöberg, Helen Schöholm, Thomas Lidin, Sarah Larsson, as well as Frida's friend Dan Daniel, Australian-British singer and actress Natalie Imbruglia, model Kate Moss, singer Kylie Minogue and the King and Queen of Sweden. And not long after that opening, on the 11th of June 2022, we had this news from one of the Voyage backing singers that the actors Ryan Gosling and Eva Mendes watched the show that night. Ryan Gosling is known for films like Drive, La La Land, Blade Runner 2049, as well as for portraying Neil Armstrong in First Man. He is actually in a relationship with Eva Mendes, who played in films like Too Fast, Too Furious, Hitch and Ghost Rider. One month later, we received this photograph of singer and actress Olivia Rodrigo. She was born in 2003, has been part of some Disney series in recent years and achieved her musical breakthrough in the past three years when she conquered charts and award shows. Another young American actress visited our voyage in July 2022. Maud Apato attended the show with Romilly Newman, a chef from New York City, and she posted some beautiful comments about her experience of the show. Nothing will ever compare. Not my wedding, not the birth of my firstborn, nothing. Those are some big words. Someone commented that this is obviously what her whole life had been leading to, to which Romilly replied that she is worried for tomorrow's come down. Someone else asked her, best night of your life, and she said, nothing will ever be the same. In the background of this photograph, you can also see the Irish actor Patrick Gibson. Only one day later, we received these amazing photographs of Voyage producer Svana Gisla together with Barry Gibb and his entire family. Just for those who really don't know, Barry Gibb is the last surviving member of the Bee Gees, a living legend. He crossed paths with ABBA a few times in the past. They were together in 1979 for a UNICEF concert and he inducted ABBA into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in 2010 together with Robin Gibb. He also wrote, produced and performed on the albums for his youngest brother Andy Gibb and he was of course together with ABBA and Olivia Newton-John on the 1978 TV special Olivia. It is beautiful and touching to see Barry Gibb at ABBA Voyage, to see him enjoying their music and give his very own acknowledgement for ABBA's new project. A few weeks ago Australian singer Dani Minogue attended the show. Her sister Kylie must have given her a recommendation. And finally, just this week, American record producer Rick Rubin was at ABBA Voyage. He is one of the most versatile producers for the most different genres, including hip-hop, heavy metal and country. He worked with artists like Jay-Z, Eminem, Mick Jagger, ACDC and Black Sabbath. It will be fascinating to see who else will watch the show in the future. But to see all of these artists so far being curious about ABBA Voyage with all their different backgrounds, just shows the wide range of others' music. I'm especially fascinated by the fact that there are so many American artists visiting. But then again, America also happens to be the number one country of viewers for this channel. Now, there is one British celebrity who I was kind of expecting to attend the show, or really hoping for, already on opening night, but we haven't seen him so far, and that is Rowan Atkinson, another living legend and one of my absolute favorite comedians. Over the years I realized that he is quite an ABBA fan. 
and I saw more and more connections in his professional life between him and Abba. Well, perhaps he will be attending the show at some point, maybe even without public fanfare, if he hasn't done that already. In any way, I will be talking about those connections very soon between Abba and Rowan Atkinson. And I also have some footage left from my trip to London, where I am visiting original locations where they shot scenes for Mr. Bean. I would love to put that together, but I would also like to have some of your improvement for that. Please let me know in the comments below if you want to go back to London with me to visit those locations of Mr. Bean. Next time, we will be traveling to Berlin in Germany and visit some of the locations where Abba was and more specifically Agneta in the late 60s. Alright, until then, hey do!